Hello friends, uh, my name is Nikhil Singh Chadak and I am working as an assistant professor in School of Vocation Studies, Ambedkar University, Delhi. Today uh, I will be discussing about the topic impact of media on culture. The subtopics which I will be covering under the same are introduction, we would be covering media, culture and tourism, their correlation, social impact, conclusion and then lastly the sum up. So, after studying this particular lesson, you will be able to describe the impact of media on culture, list the role of media with special reference to socio-cultural phenomenon, explain the place of media in promoting cultural to tourism precisely in India. So, introduction will start with the introduction. Indian society is one of the most complex societies in the world as it is cons consisted of diverse religion, caste, language, culture and arts. The influence of any new invention is worth studying and analy analyzing. Indians basically are not very receptive of new idea or technology. It takes longer time to accept an, any change in their lifestyle or anything that becomes part of their culture. Even the most educated and modern Indian needs to be convinced of usage of any new technology. Social media penetrated into India very recently and its impact is being felt very very strongly. Social media is more about sociology and psychology rather than technology. Social media has revolutionized the way people communicate and socialize on the web. So there is a positive effect on business, politics, socialization, as well as some negative effects such as cyberbullying, privacy and fake news. India as a society is the oldest civilization surviving on planet earth. Indians are very proud of their art and culture which gets passed on from one generation to another. Art and culture are two powerful complementary entities. Indian art consists of variety of art forms including painting, sculpture, pottery, textile arts such as woven, silk. Geographically it spans the entire Indian subcontinent including what is now India, Pakistan, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka, Nepal, Bhutan and Eastern Afghanistan. A strong sense of design is characteristic of Indian art and can be observed in its modern and traditional forms. The origin of Indian art can be traced to prehistoric settlements in the 3rd millennium BC. On its way to modern times, Indian art has had cultural influences as well as religious influences such as Hinduism, Buddhism, Jainism, Sikhism and Islam. In spite of this complex mixture of religious traditions, generally the prevailing artistic style at any time and place has been shared by the major religious groups. Media, culture and tourism and its correlation. Media plays very crucial role in upholding of traditional values and simultaneously it is a vehicle of change also. Similarly, tourism also performs these two functions. Traditional image is portrayed as attractive feature and the intermixing of tourists with it initiates change by mutual respect. As culture is influenced by media and tourism in almost similar fashion, it is natural that cultural and Tourism must be influenced by media policy and vice versa. So there is a huge impact of media on the Indian culture as well as the Indian tourism system. In Indian society, the things that were nearly impossible with the introduction of social media feel easier now. So social media is influencing uh, the Indian tourism and culture very strongly. Social networking sites have integrated into daily routine of millions of Indian users. The post-independence generation holds India's present and future in its hands. The decision made the pattern set by this generation of social media will affect the future. So the challenge before the Indian society is to bridge the gap between tradition and modernity. Indian government and the administration process have also brought a tremendous change in terms of adopting social media and web page use in the execution of its duties and programs. These reforms in technology have brought in various changes in the use of these web portals and social media by the public. There are so many important web portals launched by the government in the promotion and preservation of art and culture. Thus media is playing a very huge role in the overall development of Indian culture and the promotion of Indian culture and tourism. So let us clearly examine how media gives space to culture and tourism. In spite of mass media's over indulgence with politics, personalities and news of diverse types, almost every newspaper and magazine have separate sections on culture and tourism. You would get information about cinema, music, dance, festivals, handicrafts, fashion, cuisine, 
television and a whole range of cultural aspects. The culture is covered in three ways. First, as information about happenings in these areas, reviews, analysis and opinions, and lastly, through advertisements for the promotion as well as campaigns for or against specific issues. The same is the case with radio and television. Though these people know, understand and form opinions about various regions, customs and other aspects of culture, a large number of periodicals devoted exclusively to fine art, architecture, literature, etc. are also published. As far as tourism industry is concerned, they use media for promoting tourism also by various means. The means of mass media by placing new items, advertisements, sponsored features and programmers. By developing material in the form of folders, brochures, display materials, slides, newsletters, magazines, devoted to various aspects of tourism and travel. For tourism, media is a source of information for tourists. Tourists like to have some knowledge of the existing condition of the place and its culture. So if media exaggerates the impact of any event over the society, it creates doubts in the mind of tourists. So media plays a very, very vital role in terms of developing a positive impact to the tourist whenever they are planning to travel and to observe the Indian culture. Mass media is an avenue which is expected to be free from commercial compulsions. Hence, it becomes the best option to know about any particular place as its reporting is expected to be impartial. So mass media again playing a very, very important role in the overall impact on the Indian culture. Media with its extensive network caters to var varied interests including minor cultural traditions. It is by writing about them that media makes them known to the world. Media is also expected to promote and protect those minor cultural traditions which are now becoming extinct whether it is an art form or craft tradition. So there are very huge amount of untapped destinations where the culture needs to be promoted and media has a very very vital role in that. Tourist agencies are basically concerned with profits. They therefore promote only those cultural traditions which have good market value. Media also provides an option through which a tourist can share his or her experience with wider uh, world which can in turn promote more tourists to visit that particular place. It also provides an avenue by which the tourist can express his or her complaint. Media can and at times it does media between public authority and visitor. In many cases, film media has played a major promotional role in destination marketing. For example, movies are filmed at different locations depicting different aspects of natural beauty, monuments, resorts, hotels, arts and crafts, shopping centers, dresses, jewelry and what not. So there are a lot of things which are there in terms of how film media is portraying our Indian culture. This uh, to a large extent motivates people to visit the destination and encourages domestic tourism in a big way. For example, uh, the, uh, the place called Gulmarg where the Bobby film was shot was uh, again a very famous destination in terms of film tourism. The places in Havelis of Rajasthan and various places of Mysore, the gardens, the train journeys to Darjeeling and then train journeys to Darjeeling, Uti and Shimla. So the list is very long. But again, you know, the film tourism is kind of impacting the culture as well as the media is playing a very important role in it. The TV serials are playing this role in a big way. In fact, the film city itself is a big tourist attraction and many domestic tourists visit Mumbai to have a glimpse of the stars as well as the studios. Social impact. Media technology has made viewing increasingly easier as time has passed. Children today are encouraged to use media tools in school and are expected to have a general understanding of the various technologies available. So during the COVID times as well, I mean, more, uh, more so ever, we are now focused and dependent towards the technology. Most of the things are going online and media indirectly is playing a very important role in that. The internet is arguably one of the most effective tools in media. Email, Skype, Facebook and other services have brought people closer together and created new online communities. So there are so many social media communities these days are, have been developed in terms of doing some social kind of activities in terms of developing the culture, Indian culture as well. However, some argue that certain types of media can hinder face to face communication. In addition to this advertising role, media are nowadays tools for sharing knowledge around the world, analyzing the evolution of media within the society, 
Popkin assesses their role in building connections between politics, culture, economic life and society. For instance, newspapers have provided opportunities to advertisers and to readers, seeking up to date information on foreign affairs or the economy. Wilinski argues that the internet is a sustainable way to overcome the gap between developed and developing countries as both will get a chance to learn from each other in terms of the technology, cross-cultural communication and to break the national barriers. Media through uh, communication psychology has helped to connect diverse people from far and near a geographical location. It has also helped in the aspect of online or internet business and other activities that have an online version. All media intended to affect human behavior is initiated through communication and the intended behavior is couched in psychology. Therefore, understanding media and communication psychology is fundamental in understanding the social and individual effects of media. Thus, media is you know, kind of playing a huge role in terms of the psychology, in terms of the communication and all those things. The expanding field of media and communication psychology combines these established disciplines in a new way. Timing change based on innovation and efficiency may not have a direct correlation with technology. The information revolution is based on modern advancements. During the 19th century, the information boom rapidly advanced because of postal systems and increase in newspaper accessibility as well as schools modernizing. These advancements were made due to the increase of people becoming literate and educated. The methodology of communication although has changed and dispersed in numerous directions based on the source of its socio-cultural impact. Biases in the media that affect religious or ethnic minorities take the form of racism in the media and religious bias in the media. Thus, media is, has a huge role to play in terms of you know, creating a positive mindset in, in terms of the Indian culture. Furthermore, in a large consumer-driven society, electronic media such as television, print media such as newspapers are important for distributing advertisements. More technologically advanced societies have access to goods and services through newer media than less technologically advanced societies. It is not always possible to visit relatives and friends living in far off places. We want to send messages to them and also receive messages from them. The various means of communication like letters, telegrams, telephones help us to send written or spoken messages to people living in distant places. We all watch TV, read newspapers, magazines and we also go to see films. These are different means of communication with our fellow human beings. Beyond the physical requirement of food and shelter, man has now another fundamental need. This is the need of communication, the need to communicate. The urge for communication is a primal one and in our contemporary civilization, it has become a necessity for survival. Thus, media also playing a very, very huge role in terms of the communication amongst the various, various cultures. The spread of habits of Edited drinks, soft drinks have tea, coffee, smoking, certain brands of cigarettes, using certain brands of toilet soaps, detergents, hair, oil, shampoo, toothpaste, toothbrush and hair dye is, daddy, is decidedly due to the impact of television in recent times. For example, scenes of, you know, displayed in smaller screen, its commercial breaks have definitely added to the widespread intake of edited drinks of different brands. Thus, you know, media is playing a very huge impact and creating a some psychological changes in the people's mind in terms of having what kind of drinks they want to have. Covering almost every brand of uh, drinks if you talk about. Idli and dosa, the famous South Indian stuff, supposed to be a South Indian delicacy. Now with the help of media, you know, it has become largely an internationally acclaimed cuisine or you can say the food because of the mass media. And the dress, the various attires of Salwar Kameez uh, and the various attires of Punjab, the West India and so on. They have, you know, the media have created a very positive impact in the people mind as well as they are, you know, kind of being promoted with the help of media at a global level. During the middle of the last century, cinema played a very significant role in its spreading a cult associated with the worship of Santoshima. So in the closing decades of the last century, the small screen played no less significant role in carrying messages of Ramayana, Mahabharata to almost every individual, irres irrespective of the caste, religion, community, age and gender. Immense popularity of two dance forms with Bharat Natyam and Odyssey beyond the centers of their origin is definitely an impact of the media. 
and ultimately the television. The spread of Hindi language is in the length and breadth of the country is mainly due to the Hindi cinema. Particularly, songs associated with them are regularly broadcast in the radio in certain specialized programs like Vivid Bharati and so on. Later, television influenced deeply the people of all categories. Today, we see that even our day-to-day -day activity, certain words of our mother tongue have been replaced by certain linguistic expressions of the television like break ke baad, after the break or children behave in the same way the children in television behave vis-a-vis -vis their parents. These are all cases of you know the cultural influence and the influence of media. Impact of television now. The influence of television in learning mechanism is considered to be very significant. In an urban society where a substantial portion of the population are compelled to communicate in a language other than their own. A visual medium like television is considered to be more usual means of learning and communicating cultural ideas than the spoken or a written word. However, the impact of television may not always be positive. Now let us discuss the types of influence this medium exerts on our ways of life. Most of us take a cup of tea soon after we get up in the morning. If we look back how we acquired this habit is it can possibly be traced to ancient China. However, the extent to which the habits have now engulfed almost every part of the world can be traced to the commercial displays in the television. So media is you know kind of creating both positive and the negative impacts on the people mind. The influence of television in learning mechanism is considered to be very significant in the urban society. So that is why how you know the television is impacting uh, the, uh, our social culture as well as you know the, how the people have started behaving with the advent of the social media. Social media and Indian food and popular culture. Social media is a new highly effective and a powerful tool to create sensation about products, menus or food brands being launched in the Indian food market. With everyone being hooked on to social uh, media these days, it is an obvious choice for fast food joints, food and beverage companies and so on to turn to this influential medium to spread the word and create hype about their services, products, events and new items on the menu. The competitive environment has made companies to think about various strategies and social marketing techniques to kind of promote their food and the cuisine. So the online platform is playing a very huge role and uh, it has been five years since Prime Minister Shri Narendra Modi ji started Digital India campaign, an initiative to increase internet connectivity across the country, especially in rural areas. Conclusion. As the above study concludes, the main outcome is the omnipresence of social media in life of everyone irrespective of age, gender, caste, religion, educated or uneducated. It is the era of connectivity. The technology in, in itself is never good or bad. It is the way it is handled. Many critics of technology bluntly blame technology for being antisocial, allowing fake news to overpower the truth, relationships between bitter increase in violence, paving way for increasing stress and deteriorating lifestyle of human beings, but it is not so. Hence, media is, you know, in a positive, you can say in a negative way, is impacting our Indian culture. Any invention that takes place always have two sides, positive as well as negative, as I have already discussed. So it is up to the user of the particular technology to use it effectively and efficiently and towards the building of the nation in a positive way and to promote our Indian culture which has lot of potential. In our society, the things that were nearly impossible with the introduction of social media feels easier now. Social networking sites have integrated into the daily routine of millions of Indian users. So role of social media and business and consumer market in India cannot be undermined. Social media is used by various brands to build communities for interaction and spreading awareness about their services. The challenge before the Indian society is to bridge the gap between tradition and modernity. An entire social system is changing and the Indian society which was less open or close has now changed to open society. Indians are becoming more social and interactive virtually. And due to the current pandemic which is going on, whole world has come to online and doing all the things virtually. So now we are in con contact with other people mostly through virtual conferences, virtual social media platforms and so on. 
although not everybody has access to the internet and computers in indian society the fact that is it is spreading very fast cannot be undermined with a, with a deep analysis of the subject we can precisely call the social media as a tool that requires utmost cautious handling this can be highly beneficial if used appropriately undoubtedly the social media can have a very good impact on our culture and can help to spread our days old tradition with immense pleasure and prestige hence social media has a huge role to play in terms of you know promoting our indian culture to attract international tourists to attract domestic tourists to increase our domestic tourism to increase our international tourism all that requires is a firm mind good intellect and a decent approach to the available sources that is social media so friends let's sum up all the topics which we have covered today this particular unit we discuss about the various impacts of media on the indian culture and a brief history of the same was also discussed we also discussed about you know the impact of media on culture the tourism and how social media is directly correlated with the indian culture see without the presence of social media we cannot promote our indian culture which has huge potential in terms of lot of heritage sites we have in india lot of potential light lot of places lot of cultures which we have we have a diverse culture india is a land of diverse culture so that is why it is a need of the over to uh, so that social media takes a positive step in terms of developing our culture in terms of promoting our culture we also discuss about the various social aspects of culture and its influence on media furthermore significance of food of india on the media was also discussed we discussed about how you know the people who are working in the restaurant the owners of various restaurants hotels how they are you know promoting their food their accommodation and all those things in with the help of the social media platforms thank you very much